Bon Crowder with Math4.com. Math is not a four-letter word. Here talking about an experience I had with world-famous Tiagi, the interactive trainer, yesterday at a seminar. We did an activity that he calls a jolt, which is a brief exercise or activity which is meant to sort of jolt you into thinking a different way about things. So the jolt that we did was called the circles jolt and it looks like uh, one of these, not all eight. This is for example purposes. So you take this shape and you replicate it without lifting your writing utensil off the paper. So it's not that hard to do. You give a couple of minutes thought to it and you go, oh, okay, I can do that. So my initial solution was this. I come in from the left, I go up and around, in and then up and around, and then across, and I have it. So I immediately started thinking, well, okay, this thing is symmetric, so I bet there's another way to do this. So I think that I should be able to come in this side and play the game. Okay, so I come in this side and I go up and around, in. I, I am picking up the writing utensil, but you can see that you don't have to. Up and around and through. So I thought, okay, well, interesting, because if I go in and up, I could go also in and down. So I did in and down and around and down and around and across. Again, I can do it from the other side. Down and around, down and around. But if I can go down and around and down and around, or up and around and up and around, I can go down and then up, or up and then down. So I did those. So in, up, and around, in, down, and around. From the other direction, in, up, and in, down. That one got really messy, didn't it? Let's see, I have a handy dandy pink over here as well. So I can go in and I went up on those. So I can go down on these and around. And then I go up and around and through. Likewise, coming from the other direction, in, down, and around, and then up. And around. So I thought, aha, there's eight ways to do this. But you probably have already seen at least one more way, which is what happened when the teacher's pet Mark got up to demonstrate it. He did it a different way than all eight of these. So I'll show you that in the next video. This is Bon Crowder with Math4.com reminding you that math is not a four-letter word.